Hey guys, the science here, and this video I'm going to show you guys another cool science experiment. So for the science experiment, you will need a water bottle, water, and a balloon. So first you have to go ahead and take your water bottle and unscrew the cap from the bottle. So now you can go ahead and take your balloon and put the balloon inside the bottle and wrap the balloon around the neck of the bottle. So once you've done that, this is how the bottle should look. So now you can go ahead and take a pin and poke a small hole at the bottom of the water bottle. So as you guys can see, you just need a small hole and I'm just going to go ahead and blow the balloon and make sure that this hole is not covered. So once you're done blowing up the balloon, you can go ahead and use your thumb to cover the hole and this will make sure that the air doesn't run out of the balloon and it looks like the air is still inside the balloon while it's not tied off. So now I'm going to go ahead and fill the balloon with water and while you do this, just make sure your thumb remains over the hole at all times to make sure that the water doesn't spill out. So as you guys can see now there's a water balloon inside the water bottle and just make sure that you have your thumb over the hole so that the water doesn't run out. So now I'm just going to go ahead and take my thumb off the hole and empty the water out of the water balloon. So as you guys can see, the water ran out of the water balloon and now I'm just going to see how big it could blow the balloon while it's inside the bottle. So I actually covered the hole I made in the beginning with tape and made one lower to the bottle so I can make it as big as possible and this is how big I managed to make it. So now I'm just going to go ahead and take the air out and as you guys can see, each time I take my thumb off the hole, the air runs out from the balloon and the balloon gets smaller. So yeah, thanks for watching, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already, and leave a like rating for this video, and also leave a comment for a future science experiment, and I'll see if I can do it. I'll see you guys in the next video.